friend that they can go to for anything. Great. I'm so glad that we all have that special person in our lives. Now, I want you to take a second and think about what your life would be like if you didn't have that person. Hi, my name is Allie Markham, and today I'll be telling you about Best Buddies International and our four main pillars. This is important for you to hear because as a society, we need to see inclusion in our everyday lives. I've been lucky enough to be a volunteer for this organization for 10 years now, raising nearly $25,000 to help this organization continue to expand. I'm excited to tell you more about Best Buddies, and now let's dive deeper into our four main pillars. First is our one-to-one -one friendship program. This is our first and largest program located in all 50 states and 50 countries around the world, including a chapter right here at the University of Tennessee. In a 2019 article by CBS News titled Feeling Lonely, Dr. Vivek Murthy made headlines when he called loneliness a fatal epidemic. He said the increased mortality associated with loneliness is equal to the mortality of smoking 15 cigarettes a day, and even greater than the mortality of obesity. Best Buddy solves this by matching a person with a disability, a buddy with a person without a disability, a peer buddy to form a buddy pair. This buddy pair communicates once to twice a week and hangs out twice a month, but most of our buddy pairs go above and beyond. Pictured here is my buddy Lauren and I. Lauren loves old movies, fashion, and even got me to my first WWE wrestling match. <laughs> Lauren is one of the kindest and most curious people that I know, and I'm so thankful to have her in my life because of Best Buddies. Next is our newest program, the Inclusive Living Program, located only at the University of California in Los Angeles. Obviously, this is our only program that hasn't gone international, but it's only been around for two months, and I have high hopes that this, that this pillar will continue to grow worldwide. Based on my research, discrimination and abuse happens to a number of people with disabilities in their homes. In a 2017 Global Observatory for Inclusion article, titled Living Conditions Among People with Disabilities in Nepal, it is stated that 24.2% of people with disabilities have reported abuse in their own homes. Best Buddies can help with our inclusive living program. Participants must gain a part-time job to help pay for their rent. They attend three group meals and one group meeting a week to help combat loneliness, and they're provided with a roommate to help support them at a time of assistance. Next is our Integrated Employment Pillar, also known as our Jobs Program. As humans on this earth, we need jobs to support ourselves. And there are many barriers preventing people with disabilities from gaining employment. In a 2005 study by Kansas University Center for Research on Learning, it was discovered that in developing countries, 80 to 90% of people with disabilities of working age are unemployed. Specifically, in Asia and the Pacific, there are 238 million people with disabilities of working age, and the employment rate is 80%. Jobs bridge the gap of inclusion in the workplace by finding participants a job that fits their needs and interests and a job coach that will continue to help support them throughout their career. Finally is our leadership development pillar, also known as our ambassador program. Everyone has the capability to be a leader, but not everyone is given the chance. People with disabilities are often not given an equal opportunity. In a 2015 Global Citizens Report titled Living with a Disability in a Developing World, it is stated that the United Kingdom's Department for International Development suggests that children with disabilities are not given equal opportunities in their school. The Ambassador Program gives people with disabilities the opportunity to be leaders through advocacy training and public speaking. Global ambassadors like Jack Mayer, pictured here, give their speeches worldwide about how Best Buddies has impacted their lives. In conclusion, today I have talked about Best Buddies International and our four main pillars, one-to-one -one friendships, inclusive living, integrated employment, and leadership development. What started out as a fun way to volunteer has turned into a life-changing experience that I will forever be grateful for. Best Buddies has given me so much in my life and I am so thankful for them. And I want to end with a quote by Missy Naff, the Director of Programs for Best Buddies Tennessee. A friend is one of the nicest things that you can have and one of the best things that you can be. So I encourage you all to be a friend to someone today. Any questions?
have a question for me. How might a UT student get involved with Best Buddies? Yeah, you actually go to bestbuddiesonline.org and you click membership application and you'll sign up there. Yeah. How many buddies have you had? Is, I know they had one. Have you had others? Yes. So I actually started my um, high school chapter in Memphis and um, I had my first buddy there and her name was Mallory. Um, and then I came to UT and I was matched with Lauren. But um, I've made a special connection with, I feel like, every single one of our buddies in our chapter. Yeah. Thank you.